tripping, bro. Now, I got to tell y'all a story. Because I want y'all niggas to know. I want y'all to tell me if I'm honestly in the wrong, bro. This unrelated. I'm trying to think how to tell this story. Okay. Me and my me and my mans, right? Me and my mans were at some dinner. We're getting food with these two girls, right? Now, it's not no, it wasn't, it's not no two man. One of the girls is dating my other mans, not the one across the table. Pause. But he's she's dating, she dating one of my friends. But my, the boy I was with when we went out to get food, there she he's friends with her, so it's not no big deal. It's not on no weird shit. You get what I'm saying? And he knew we was with her, so it don't matter, right? So we getting food, bro. You know, I had the greatest chicken. Uh, I had the greatest chicken sandwich of all my fucking time, bro. And I'm gonna order it on stream this week to show y'all how goddamn good it is. Buffalo chicken with blue cheese sauce, bro. Not Chick Fil A. Don't compete, and y'all know I'm Chick Fil A biggest supporter. Popeyes definitely don't compete with a dirty ass. KFC definitely not competing. Burger King. Bitch ass nigga, don't even ask me that. Best chicken sandwich of all time. I'm going to show y'all. I'm going to show y'all. Let me show y'all what it looked like right now, actually. Mind you, it's from a burger spot. It's a, at a burger joint. And it's still the best chicken sandwich of all time. I'm giving them free promo, but I don't care, bro. Oh, no, no, no. Where is it? Bear Burger, nigga. This not bear burger, bro. Ew, no, this is nasty. It don't look like this. Yo, I don't know, bro. I don't know, bro. I don't know. I can't, I can't. It looked more like that, but. Now I'm not getting large. I'm the lowest I ever weighed in a long minute, so eat this meat up. Anyways, back to the story. We at dinner, right? Now, let me tell y'all something like this. My friend, two weeks for Drake. Okay. My friend is one of them friends that don't know how, like, he can't dress for shit. And I know I'm wearing this, but bitch, this swagger. He don't, you feel me? That nigga real, real life cannot dress. Like, when we go out, he wear the, he consistently wear this all black hoodie. And just these weak ass cargo gray shorts, some bullshit. Okay? Everyone knows this nigga cannot dress. So, you know, people... Y'all, thank you for that dono, bro. I know your breath was stinking with that blur cheese and buffalo. Your bitch ass Shorty up, nigga. She has some it. too. So guess what? Who really care? Dumb ass nigga. You carry Tic Tacs everywhere you go. Why? Because you have chronic stinking breath. I don't have that. I don't need gum everywhere I go. So, back to the story. You know, we're chilling. I'm going to say this as a predecessor so y'all can understand more, bro. Hold on, I got to mute y'all real quick. Thank you for that Max, donut. I made you his Drake album covers. I bet. I'm going through the Reddit today, so I'm going to see. There's been times in the past we've been out at parties. And mind you, my friend is a hothead, the nigga that can't dress. We've been out, and one of my friends will cook this nigga fit in front of a girl and just go in on this nigga, like violate him. Say you're fit trash as fuck. Violate the nigga fit in front of all the women. Now, the most recent time that happened... <laughs> They said his fist was trash. This nigga then goes and says about my friend in front of the women. He says, you stink, though. Like on some serious shit. My friend genuinely had stinky allegations. He was known to be a smelly nigga. So he goes and says, you stink, though. Right? Okay? So understand that. That is the backdrop. Like, this nigga's a hothead. I call him. I don't want to say what I call him because I say his race. and might give it away a little bit. But we call this nigga Mini Hulk. I gave him that nickname. He gets green. He gets mad. He gets angry. He blows up. He screams. Right? So we're at this dinner. And he, he like, we were out before because we had got our nails done. As y'all see, I'm a clean ass. Hold on. What the fuck? Damn, I got a hangnail already. But I got my nails done yesterday. They clean, bitch. They clean. So anyways. Oh, I thought someone opened the door. I'm tripping. But, um. We had went home, he dropped me off, and then we went back out because I had to change. I thought he had changed too. So we're at this dinner where I have the best chicken sandwich of my goddamn life. And, you know, this nigga want to be talking. He's talking. He says, yo, I got to go home and change and shit. And I'm like, 
Apparently, he had told me he was going to change before, but I forgot. So I say, change for what? I say, change for what? What do you have to change for? And the guy thought you changed already. This nigga goes and says, damn, you're going for swag. You're going for swag. You're going for swag. If you don't know what going for swag means, going for swag means like you're trying to embarrass a nigga. Y'all ever heard of that? I mean, like you damn, like you, you fronting, like you trying to make a nigga look bad in front of the hoes type shit or whatever. Like, for example, if I say that, if I'm playing a game with a basketball with my friends and I'm talking shit and I tell my friend, I'm like, yo, you suck at basketball. You ask, my friend says, well, that's why you got herpes. And I actually have herpes. That's going for swag. He's trying to make me look bad. He's doing some extra shit. You know what I'm saying? I don't have herpes, my nigga. Um, but anyways, back to the story, though. So he's saying you're going for swag. I'm like, my nigga, how am I going for swag? Now, he's saying this for a couple of minutes. I'm like, what? Bro, how I'm going for swag? I'm enjoying this chicken. I'm enjoying this blue cheese. And I'm enjoying this brioche bread. And you talking all this shit. So he said, ask Blank, who's sitting across from me. I was about to say her name. God dying. Thank you for the sub. He says, ask Blank. I said, okay. I asked her. I say, am I going for swag? Mind you, I had said, what do you need to change for? I said, am I going for swag? She says, no. Look at his fit. Which is implying he has that doggy doggy on, right? It's implying he's wearing that doggy. So, right? Now I get on him, I'm like, yeah, yo, yeah, this shit trash, right? Mind you, both of these girls are his friends. He has no, there's no intentions of nothing with them. So, fast forward, he's like, yo, he's in a, he's like, yo, I'm gonna text the group chat, which is our friends. He's like, yo, I'm gonna tell, I'm gonna tell these niggas what you did tonight. I said, okay, I'm going to beat you to it. I pull my phone out. I'm recording. <laughs> now, this is the part where I'm dead wrong. I'm going to be honest. I pull out my phone. I'm recording him. But I'm explaining the story. The reason I'm explaining the story and recording his shit is because this nigga is a liar. He's a liar, bro. He lies about the stories. He does too much. So I'm recording him. And I'm like, I'm explaining, yo, this is what happened. I'm not laughing. I'm just explaining the story. He slams my phone on the Love table. Love Maxi. Thank you for the sub. He slams my phone on the table. Now it's like, whatever. I'm still, I'm laughing now. I think it's a joke. Let me show y'all, bro. This is, he slammed my phone. I lost my video. This is what I was left with. Oh, you can hear the audio. <laughs> but look, that's all I'm left with. Just bullshit. Because he slammed my shit. Anyways, thank you for the sub. He slammed it on some shit. I had my phone up. He just hit it. He's like, take that out. I'm like, all right, this nigga getting tight. So I'm laughing because I just laugh. So now we're out. Okay, you, bro, his shit, you're, it don't matter, my nigga. So anyway, we're walking away. We're talking about it. Now we're talking. Thank you for that sub. We, what this nigga do? Yo, why are you spamming, my nigga? Hold on, bro. I got to ban you. You're annoying. This nigga is spamming, bro. We're walking back to the car. This nigga calls up my mans. He tend to call a nigga up. He tend to call a nigga up to figure out our problems instead of us just discussing as men. He call my friend up. We're talking. As I'm trying to explain my side, he's hogging the phone. Bitch, give me some minutes. I hate when niggas do that. Let me talk. You're not letting me talk, my nigga. So now he's just talking. He's talking. He's talking. He's lying. He's talking. He's lying. He's talking. I finally get the phone. We walked ahead. The girl's finally back at the car. He's saying, get in the car. I'm like, no, nigga, it's my time to shine. I'm trying to walk away from the car to explain this story. But this nigga keep pulling the car up next to me. So they gonna hear. He's getting mad that they're hearing, but you're pulling the whip up. Right? We back, get back in the car. He's talking about nights over. We were supposed to go somewhere after. He's talking about nights over. I'm going to drop my niggas off. He's saying, oh, I'm finna go drop these girls off. We're going home. I'm like, my nigga. And he says, we could talk about it later. I'm like, no, let's talk about it now. You dropped them off. The night's over. I'm trying to explain it. He's getting mad. He's now speeding through the road. He's speeding through the road like shit. And this girl that is dating my mans, texts my mans and says, I'm scared for my life. This nigga is, you feel me? He driving crazy type shit. You get what I'm saying? So y'all tell me where I went wrong, bro. I know I, I know the recording was OD. The recording was OD. But, bro, I'm trying to have a civil combo with this nigga in the whip. And he's screaming at me and speeding, bro. 
Does that make any sense? Niggas at every park. In front of in front of these women, bro. In front of these women. Yo, if I said hoes, I ain't mean no offense to that, because I'm actually friends with them. No offense, you feel me? Yeah, I just be talking on this bitch. But do y'all see what I'm saying? Bro, we zoomed over a speed bump. Y'all know when y'all going fast over a speed bump, you fly in that bitch, you get a little levitation. Nigga, we levitating, bro. I feel like Superman. This should not be happening, bro. No new friends. No, it's not about new friends. That's my nigga. We discussed it after. But, bro, that was tweaking. How was I tweaking? The only thing that was a tweak was, okay, recording them. I know that. I shouldn't have been recording them. But we all friends. I'm just, you feel me? It's on some funny shit. But I know I went too far with that. And the only reason that ha I'm sensitive. What? This nigga Hulk smashing me in the whip. He going Hulk more. I'm sensitive. Nigga, I'm trying to talk to this nigga regular. I'm sensitive. What? That nigga is crying, bro. Pause, pause, pause. Hulk smash. I ain't mean that on no gay shit. Come on, bro. I ain't mean that on no gay shit. Y'all know what I'm saying, though, bro. Like, bro, we are... This nigga screaming at me in front of these women. I'm like, my nigga, I'm trying to talk. At first, I'm laughing. I think it's not that serious. Shit gets serious.